Hello, I'm Mentris and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4 as Vichy France, Fascist France. So, uh, today, well, we'll probably declare war on China, because why would you not? I've also noticed that we've got a lot of troops out here we got given that uh, I have completely forgotten about. Hi, thank you for joining me. I actually own territory over here, which I completely forgot about because of Czechoslovakia, and I'm like, yeah, maybe we should just fight Poland? Because? I mean, we've got troops here? I mean, it gives us something to do with them. Sure, why not? Okay, uh... I don't... I think you get your own theater, really. 30... 30 troops. Bloody hell. Okay, new theater. Uh, you are... Central Europe. Uh, you... are Asia. Specifically China, but we'll just go with Asia now, because I don't know exactly what we're doing with the troops when we get there. Uh, so Central Europe. You'll need a field marshal, because you have so many of you. So let's grab um, Maxim Weinau. Uh, entrenchment. Ugh. Entrenchment's no use for us, but oh well. And then... Wow, 100 divisions. I can't really match anywhere near that, but uh, we'll do what we can. And then, the idea is we're going to do an offensive line, pushing up. We'll try and grab Warsaw if we can. This is going to put us like square in the path of the Soviet Union, but eh. What could possibly go wrong? Uh, hello. Just for war goal, conquer. Right. And frankly, I can claim multiple things because it costs the same. It takes the same amount of time. Right, I want to try and grab... What's this? Low. High. In the middle. Uh, yeah. Get working on that. We also need to actually send some forces over here to start garrisoning down here properly, which we're currently not doing. Uh, maybe consider a war against Turkey as well. Don't stretch myself too thin, though. Now, once we have enough uh, support in the United States for fascism, we're going to start a um, coup. That coup is going to try and get all our support and hopefully get them to join the Axis. Advanced machine tools. Sweet. Um, I'll go factory repair speed plus 50%. Because we are getting a little bit bombed from uh, Britain right now. Hi. Hi, Poland. I'm dreadfully sorry, but I'm not sorry about this at all. I remember the Axis. I have to roleplay it. Ah, we want to fight you. Uh, yeah. Okay. Hi. Enjoy. And we got Lithuania in. That's fine. Now, unfortunately, we only have infantry here, so uh, we lack some of the other more important things in life. Uh, free dockyards. Oh, he sunk four, four of my convoys? Oh, we sunk a battleship, though. Well, it's mostly the German air support, but whatever. So, you know, British battleship down. And they lost a, uh, that was a heavy cruiser. Destroyer. Destroyer. I'm getting somewhere. We need to cut, cut them off here at Gibraltar. We really do. Um, Naval dockyards. What are we currently building? We really need to upgrade our naval designs. We really don't have enough at the moment. Um, I'll start building a couple of battleships, but I do fear that they're not powerful enough to really take anyone on. But we'll build the Corbett class. Also, we should definitely have a look at our divisions. I've been meaning to edit these for a little while. So, uh, paratroopers. Logistics company. Save. Now, I'll give them more supplies so they can last a little bit longer. Um, what else? Medium armor. Sure. 
Sure, logistics company. Save that. Um, it's a light tank brigade. I ignore you for the moment. This is more what I'm going to be interested in doing the uh, sort of mechanized infantry sort of uh, combined arm stuff. But for now, we're going to ignore you as well. Alpine. Yeah, you want logistics, support artillery, field hospital, and recon. Uh, motorized, logistics, field hospital. And then basic infantry. Whoops, wrong one. Basic infantry, I want you to have a field hospital, recon, and logistics. Enjoy. Now, this is probably going to mean that we need a lot more basic supplies. If we check... Yeah, we need a few thousand. So, buff you to the top. For now. How do we construction? Uh, a lot of damage stuff. Oh, okay. Poland declared war on Lat... Poland declared war on someone? Poland called Estonia in, they declared war on Latvia. Oh, maybe it's just because Latvia just got made or something. No, it's... Anyway. Um, Latvia drawn comma turn. Fine. We're doing okay here. Could be doing better. Can I call you into my war? Call to arms. The French-Polish war. We'll have to share the spoils of war, but I feel that's acceptable. If he wants to send 42 divisions, okay. Sure. What the hell? Yeah, okay. Wow, that is a... That is a lot of help! Right, how are we doing currently in China? How have forces got there yet? No, still on the way. Right, we've managed to get our tanks. So let's go armor reform straight up. That's going to really help with us uh, having um, really low speed... Uh, research for land doctrines. We also need to really get a work on with land doctrines. Right, three Canadian uh, convoy ships down. Oh! The British launched an amphibious assault against Italy. Hell no! This is important. This means that Britain has the ability to do amphibious assaults. So we're going to have to start thinking about defending ourselves better. Like this 12 over here. Apart from the uh, mountains, because you know, we can't really use those. Um, you're going to have to go over to Africa and start defending these ports, because I don't want them taking my oil supply away. Maintenance company. And... Yeah, we can get Mark twos of these. So, Logistics Company 2, reduce these supplies. Currently having to fight the Soviet Union to try and get space as quickly as possible. It's mine! Back off, Soviet Union. Oh, bye, Lithuania. We hardly knew ye. Non-aggression pact from Latvia. Oh, look, I'll sign it. Okay, come on. 90. 95. 98. Yes! Aha! The important part was we're cutting off um, Soviet Union so we can try and grab some Poland before they can. Yugoslavia joined the Allies. Yugoslavia called United Kingdom into the... Wow. Hungary declared... Oh, Alright, that's what started it. Hungary declared war on Yugoslavia. Um, not much of an issue for us, although I do think we're going to have to send some of our forces back that we got from Italy. 
this is a problem. Okay, they're sending forces back over. Uh, I'm gonna have to delete this because it looks like Soviet Union is gonna definitely beat us to that one. And we're gonna just push up here, try and grab as much as we can of that. All right. Yep, 98, 99. Ah, oh, no. Back down here. We lost four convoy ships. God, I'm British. Yeah, they're managing to be pushed out now. How are we doing down in South Africa? Now, it's slow going down here because of supplies. You see, a lot of units are sitting back here. The reason they're sitting back here. Oh, not you. Um, you? No. Oh. We, is it you? Yeah, a lot of the reason they're sitting back here is because they don't want to, like, waste our supplies by going down here and then getting into a supply uh, lax region. So we're actually going to start building some infrastructure here. Try and get infrastructure from the port. Get supplies in place. How are we doing? Yeah, we are managing to push a bit now. Come on, get me Warsaw. I want the points it'll be worth. And that way when we get peace, we can be like, yeah, I want a lot of stuff. Give me a Warsaw. Come on. If the is capitulated. You didn't join the Allies, did you? No. So it should be a separate war. Let's cut off there. Full of Warsaw. China's capitulate. No! I just got my forces in position. Oh, great news! The fall of Warsaw. Poland did not stand a chance. Okay. Well, congratulations, Japan. Congratulations, Asia. <sighs> okay. Um, new plan. Uh, your front line. Siam. We're going to have some fun here. And your offensive line. Let's try and get to Bangkok. And then from there, close this off. Have fun with that. Start pushing. Tommy wants to send another seven divisions. Okay, sure. Keep sending me stuff. It's because they see me as like getting stuff done. Like I'm taking names and stuff and the entire countries. And they're like, yeah, cool. We'll support that. I mean, as well they should. Uh, all right. You're the Middle East theatre. So I need no theatre now. Where are the other troops? Oh, don't tell me they got killed en route. I thought there were more than this. I could have sworn we had more. You theatre. You're Middle East. Right. Your job is no commander. Garrison. Yeah. Just make sure that never falls into enemy hands. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, I thought it was a battle group. No, it's okay. It's just just uh, Belgian convoys. That's fine. I thought it was a battle group attacking our subs. Okay. Annexation of Poland is going smoothly. Although we are starting to run out of manpower a little bit. 
Oh, that was totally mine. Why did you grab Warsaw? God damn it. Low supplies. Yeah, be expected. Battle plans, no unit signed. Signal company. Sweet. Now. I'll get that soon. Computing machine. Yes. One day ahead of time. It's uh, next year. Bam, next year. Opponents capitulated. And yeah, I had the second most war score. Only two behind the Soviet Union. Okay, um, you we want to take Polsi. In which case, I would like to take... Honestly, I could be a massive dick and take Danzig. Can I connect these together? No. Right, I can take those. So I'm going to grab those because they're next to my existing area. Or could I grab Krakow? No, I'd want to be able to connect them together, so... Done. Everyone else goes through and gets what they want. Yeah, you grab Danzig. It's expected. I'm going to grab Krakow and can I grab anything else? No. I'm going to grab Krakow. And then I can puppet. Let me puppet one of them. Or I could grab more land. How much land could I grab? Not much. I'm going to puppet uh, Estonia. Because if we have a war against the Soviet Union, we can use it as a stopping point to launch a northern attack and try and encircle their forces. Can't afford anything. Done. I took three, so you took nine. German Reich took six. Terra Marina was puppeted. Hello. You're my puppet. <laughs> and Vichy France now has control of a little province over here, which is really, really weird. But sure. Uh, it also means that uh, we now have 72 units here. We're completely and utterly bored. We're going to have to consider starting an amphibious invasion of the United Kingdom. We've got enough units to be able to consider it. For now, I'm going to give you garrison orders. I mean, we could attack someone. Like Turkey? Ooh, we could attack Turkey. What is Turkey leaning to at the moment? Not really. Maybe slightly towards democracy. We're going to see how the war in Siam goes first. So, let's look at the Asia Theatre. So we're pushing in there. You look less certain. Actually, you look okay. Let's start it. Just for war goal. Conquer. Now, because we can, I'll definitely set stations some aircraft over here for the support bonus. That said, we don't actually have many aircraft. Italy is currently contested. I've got tactical bombers over here in Champagne that are doing uh, not much. So, yeah, I'll send you over here. I want you from Indochina. I'll need some fights as well. I've only got the two units of fighters. <sighs> 
Right. I'm going to reduce your numbers, which will send some back to the reserves. Just so that I can have a few. And then we can find... I'll find some still being sent back to the reserves, I think. Oh, there we go. Okay, not a big air wing, but it'll do. They're getting shipped across. Come on, deploy them. Nash of Spain, join the Axis. Yes, take out Gibraltar, please. Please do. I'm angered by Siamese posturing, regardless of his ready the people for war. And they're calling uh, to the war. That's fine. Right, there we go. You can't really cover the area effectively. Is there a better place to, like, station you? I guess I can station you down here. You're getting this negative from uh, lacking range to complete cover area. Being similar here. Right, we've justified our war. And that's what we're going to be doing next time. So I've been at Aurelisium. Hopefully in next time we'll be able to crush um, all the enemies facing us. Until then, if you liked, like, not subscribe, please consider subscribing. And of course, stay shiny.